Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we are going to learn about prime and composite numbers from 41 to 50. It's simple and very easy. Now let's move on the video. Prime and composite numbers from 41 to 50. We learn prime number has only two factors. Composite number has more than two factors. Okay, how to find a number prime or composite? We have to find all the factors of a number. Then only we can say that number is prime or composite. Let's see for 41. 1 is a factor of every number. So, 1s are 41, 41. Here, there is one simple method. Here, there is a simple and easy method for finding two digit number a prime or composite we learn table of 2 to 12 have any chance to see 41 in any table no there is no combination of 41 so 41 multiple of 41 so 41 multiple of 41 41 are 41 now we got all the factors of 41 1, 41. We learn a number get only two factors. That number is prime number. So, 41 is a prime number. 42. 1 is a factor of every number. So, 1s are 42, 42. 42 is a multiple of 2 because in the 1s place is a even number. So, when we divide 42 by 2, we get quotient 21. Now, here 21 is a another factor of 42. So, 2s are 21, 42. 42 is a multiple of 3. 42 is a multiple of 3. We learn divisible rule of 3. When we add the digit of 42, we get 6. 6 is a multiple of 3. So, 42 is a multiple of 3. When we divide 42 by 3, we get quotient 14. Here 14 is a another factor of 42. So, 3s are 14, 42. 42 is not multiple of 4. 42 is not multiple of 5. But 42 is a multiple of 6, which is 6 or 7, 42. 42 is a multiple of 7, which is 7 or 6, 42. Now we got all the factors of 42 because 6 and 7 have occurred earlier. So now we got all the factors of 42. 1, 2, 3, 6, 7, 14, 21, 42. Factors of 42. 1, 2, 3, 6, 7, 14, 21 and 42. We learn a number get more than two factors. That number is composite number. So, 42 is a composite number. Next, 43. 1 is a factor of every number. So, 1s are 43, 43. 43 is not multiple of 2. 43 is not multiple of 3. There is no combination of 43. At last, 43 multiple of 43, which is 43 is our 1, 43. Factors of 43, 1 and 43. We learn a number get only two factors. That number is prime number. Next, 44. 1 is a factor of every number. So, 1s are 44, 44. 44 is a multiple of 2, which is 2s are 22, 44. 44 is not multiple of 3. We know the divisible rule. When we add the digit of 44, we get 8. 8 is not multiple of 3. So, 44 is not multiple of 3. 44 is a multiple of 4. When we divide 44 by 4, we get quotient 11. Here, 11 is here another factor of 44. So, 4s are 11, 44. 
44 is not multiple of 5. 44 is not multiple of 6. We know 44 is a multiple of 11, which is 11 are 4, 44. Now we got all the factors of 44 because 4 and 11 occurred earlier. When we the number gets occurred earlier, you got all the factors. We got all the factors of 44. 1, 2, 4, 11, 22, 44. Factors of 44, 1, 2, 4, 11, 22 and 44. We learn a number get more than two factors. That number is a composite number. So, 44 is a composite number. 45 is a multiple of 3. Because when we add the digit of 45, 4 plus 5, we get 9. 9 is a multiple of 3. So, 45 is a multiple of 3. So, divide 45 by 3, we get 15. 15 is a another factor of 45. So, 3 is 15, 45. 45 is not multiple of 4. 45 is a multiple of 5, which is 5 or 9, 45. 45 is not multiple of 6. 45 is not multiple of 7. 45 is not multiple of 8. At last, 45 is a multiple of 9, which is 9 or 5, 45. Now, we got all the factors of 45. Because 5 and 9 have occurred earlier. So, now we got all the factors of 45. 1, 3, 5, 9, 15, 45. Factors of 45, 1, 3, 5, 9, 15 and 45. We learn a number get more than two factors. That number is called composite number. 45 is a composite number. Next. 46. 1 is a factor of every number. So, 1s are 46, 46. 46 is a multiple of 2 because in the ones place is even number. So, 46 is a multiple of 2. When we divide 46 by 2, we get quotient 23. Here, 23 is a another factor of 46. So, 2s are 23, 46. 46 is not multiple of 3. Already we learned divisible rule of 3. When we add the digit of 46, we get 10. Which is 4 plus 6, 10. So, 10 is not multiple of 3. So, 46 is not multiple of 3. 46 is not multiple of 4. At last, we got 46 is a multiple of 23. Which is 23 star 2, 46. Now we got all the factors of 46 because 2 and 23 have occurred earlier. We got all the factors of 46. 1, 2, 23, 46. Factors of 46. 1, 2, 23 and 46. We know a number get more than two factors. That number is composite number. So 46 is here. Composite number. Next, 47. 1 is a factor of every number. So, 1s are 47, 47. 47 is not multiple of 2. Because in the 1s place is not even number. So, 47 is not multiple of 2. Have you any chance to see 47 in any table? No, there is no combination. So, 47 at last. Multiple of 47, which is 47 are 1, 47. Factors of 47, 1 and 47. We learn a number get only two factors. That number is prime number. So, 47 is a prime number. Next, 48. 1 is a factor of every number. So, 1s are 48, 48. 48 is a multiple of 2, which is 2s are 24, 48. 48 is a multiple of 3, 
we learn divisible rule of 3. When we add the digit of 48, we get 12, which is 4 plus 8, 12. 12 is a multiple of 3. So, 48 by 3, we get quotient 16. Here, 16 is a another factor of 48. So, 3 is 16, 48. Next, 48 is a multiple of 4. We know the divisible rule of 4. In the ones place is a multiple of 4. That number is divisible of 4. So, when we divide 48 by 4, we get quotient 12. 12 is a another factor of 48. So, 4 is 12, 48. 48 is not multiple of 5. But 48 is a multiple of 6, which is 6 or 8, 48. 48 is not multiple of 7. 48 is a multiple of 8, which is 8 or 6, 48. Now, we got all the factors of 48. Because 6 and 8 have occurred earlier. So, now we got all the factors of 48. 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, 12, 16, 24, 48. We learn a number get more than two factors. That number is composite number. So, 48 is a composite number. Next, 49. 1 is a factor of every number. So, 1 is 49, 49. 49 is not multiple of 2. Because in the 1's place is not even number. So, 49 is not multiple of 2. 49 is not multiple of 3 because when we add the digit of 49, which is 4 plus 9, 13. 13 is not multiple of 3. So, 49 is not multiple of 3. 49 is not multiple of 4. 49 is not multiple of 5. 49 is not multiple of 6. At last, 49 is a multiple of 7, which is 7 star 7, 49. Now, we got all the factors of 49 because when we get both the factors are same. Now, we got all the factors of 49 because both the factors are same. When we get both the factors are same, that number get all the factors. So, 7 star 7, 49. Factors of 49, 1, 7, 49. We learn. A number get more than two factors. That number is composite number. So, 49 is a composite number. You have to remember this. You got all the factors of a number. There is two rules. When you get a number have occurred earlier. The both number occurred earlier. That time you got all the factors of a number. When you get the factors are same. That time, you got all the factors of number. Next, 50. 1 is a factor of every number. So, 1s are 50, 50. 50 is a multiple of 2 because in the 1s place is a1 number. So, 50 is a multiple of 2. When we divide 50 by 2, we get quotient 25. Here, 25 is a another factor of 50. So, 2s are 25, 50. 50 is not multiple of 3. Because when we add the digit of 50, we get 5. 5 is not multiple of 3. So, 50 is not multiple of 3. 50 is not multiple of 4. But 50 is a multiple of 5. Which is 5 star 10, 50. We know at last 50 is a multiple of 10. Which is 10 star 5, 50. Now we got all the factors of 50. Because 5 and 10 have occurred earlier. So now we got all the factors of 50. 1, 2, 5, 10, 25 and 50. Factors of 50. 1, 2, 5, 10, 
25 and 50. We learn a number get more than two factors. That number is a composite number. 50 is a composite number. Prime numbers of 41 to 50, 41, 43 and 47. Composite numbers of 41 to 50, 42, 44, 45, 46, 48, 49, 50. I hope you understand the concept of prime and composite numbers. Thank you for watching. And please share your feedback and comment in the video comment section. And please comment down below which step have you reached today. That is it for the today's video. Thanks for watching.